students i'm ilama mia today i'm going to teach you chapter number 11 that is time today my topic is conversion of time the smaller units into bigger units okay today topic is conversion of time smaller units into bigger units bigger unit okay smaller units into bigger units okay so please take your notebooks and book also okay i am doing here 135 page practice one number two first of all i would like to tell you key to convert hours into days divide the hours by 24 to convert hours into days you will divide by 24 because in one day there are 24 hours so whatever hours are given to you you will divide those hours by 24 and whatever quotient you will get that will be days and the remainder will be the remaining hours whenever you are given for so you are given minutes you are given minutes and you are asked to convert the minutes into hours then you will divide the given minutes by 60 and whatever quotient you will get that will be the hours and the remaining that remainder will be the remaining minutes if remainder is zero and whatever the quotient is with you that will be the hour that will be the when minutes divided by 60 you are going to get time in hours okay whatever quotient you will get that will be the hours similarly whenever seconds are given to you and you are asked to convert those seconds the given seconds into minutes then the given seconds will be divided by 60 and whatever quotient you will get that will be the minutes and whatever remainder will be there that will be the remaining seconds okay and if you are given like here here when you are given only seconds and you are asked to convert into hours then first of all you will convert those seconds into minutes and whatever minutes you will get further those minutes will be divided by 60 to convert into hours those minutes into hours so Today we are going to learn here today conversion of time the smaller units into bigger units. When smaller units are being converted into bigger units then we divide then we divide. But for that you should learn complete here formulas ki in one day there are 24 hours in one hour there are 60 minutes in one minute there are 60 seconds okay. So, and in one year, there are how many days? 365 days. In one year, how many months are there? There are 12 months. All the units should be learned by you carefully and only then you will be able to solve the given problem. So, let's proceed here today. Practice zone 2, convert 4560 minutes into days. So, First of all, these minutes will be converted into hours. Into hours, okay? One, one hour is equal to 60 minutes, as you know. So, when 4560 will be divided by 60, the unit will be converted into hours into hours because minutes are being divided by 60 and you will get the time in hours so divide 4560 by 60 hurry up take out your book notebook pen pencil whatsoever is with you and divide it hurry up and give you time are you doing the right one here hurry up You 
can write table of 60 aside here. Table of 60, you can write here. 60 by 60. Can write table of 16. Okay. Then yes, you will decide table of 60 till what? This is 420. Okay, and this is more than 460, 56. So you will decide table of 60 till 8. Okay, you are going to get to say. Sorry, you will get here 7, okay? You will cite Okay, you will cite table of 16 till what? Till 7, till 7, you will get 420. So, 6, 20 and recite table of 60 till you are 6. You are getting 360. Are you doing like this? Okay. Now, you are having here total how much? 76. 76 hours. Okay. Now, you are going to convert these hours into days. Into days. So, now, when these 76 hours will be divided by 24, you will get time in days. In days. So, divide 76 by 24. 24, 3, 72. And these will be the Three days and four here. Four are how much hours? Three days and four hours. Okay. Please note down. Please note down. Whenever the Smaller units are being converted into bigger, then you will divide with the proper units. With the proper units, okay? Please note down. And question number 2 is convert 78,450 seconds into hours. So, to do that, this question, first of all, the seconds will be Converted into minutes. Into minutes. Then whatever minutes you get will be converted into hours. By dividing again by 60. Again divide by dividing six, dividing by 60. Okay. This is a practice zone 2. Okay. You are getting 3 days 4 hours. Okay. Now. Have you done so that I can do other part, other question? Okay. You will subtract here. Then, how to convert 78,450 seconds into hours? First of all, seconds will be divided by 60 to convert into minutes. To convert into minutes. So, by dividing... 78,450 by 60. 78,450 seconds were equal to 1,307 minutes and 30 seconds. Okay. Now, these minutes will be converted into now hours by dividing by 60. As soon as you divide by 60, the minutes will be converted into hours. 
will be converted into hours and plus here 30 second you will take as it is okay then now divide 1300 now divide 1307 by 60 and you will get the time in hours so recite table of 60 till 2 then 61 ja 60 okay now you are left with here 21 hours because the minutes were divided by 60 to convert into hours so now you are having 21 hours 47 minutes so in short you can say e78450 seconds equal is equal to how much 21 hours after hours the smaller unit is minutes 47 minutes and this 30 seconds and 30 seconds okay this is question number 2 okay of practice on 2 of your book discovering maths discovering maths okay you will complete practice on 1 2 okay Thank you.